where this road is supposed to lead We got nothing but time As long as you're right here next to me Everything's gonna be alright If it's meant to be warriors welcome to another video if you are new to my channel thanks for being here and I'm gonna talk about today what I'm thankful for instead of doing the Sunday dinner show cuz of course I still have Thanksgiving leftovers okay um, I seen um, a video from Fearless Beam, now known as, I think is Renee Savage. She has some, somebody hashtag her or something like that, of, uh, you know, to do, I guess it's called a tag, I'm not sure, of, you know, what you're thankful for. And they, I don't have the questions that, um they put down so I'm just gonna tell you in general what I'm thankful for so what am I thankful for as of right now I have survived 20 twin twin okay I am thankful for health life and strength to breathe another day I am thankful for um my children, they are still here with me. Knock on some wood. They have not been in any physical type of trouble. Honestly, they all graduated from high school. Um, three have attempted to go to college. One is in the makings. And I'm thankful to have been able to cook Thanksgiving dinner because I have told y'all in the past that unfortunately I was one that has not cooked Thanksgiving dinner in six years due to my living arrangements, um, probably five of those years. And I'm just blessed and highly favored to be able to participate um, with YouTube on, you know, showing you, you know, what I was able to cook. It was my first long video and honey, editing that bad baby was a mess. <laughs> but I'm thankful I made it through that storm. <laughs> Um, I'm thankful that 2021 is coming and we can end, you know, a lot of stuff that happened this year and begin something new. I'm thankful for my boo. Thankful for being able to spend time with him. We had a bet going on about the elections <laughs> and you know he lost <laughs> hello now I'm not saying that the vote that he cast made him lose I'm saying he, lo he lost um, what he thought was going to happen <laughs> let's put it like that let's keep it on the, 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 the PG okay instead of R rated <laughs> but I'm thankful for that this week in has was a scare for me um, someone close to me was fighting for their life not C-19 but just trying to be a mother because you become a mother when that embryo 
first come into your belly, you become a mother. Let me turn a little bit. And I am thankful that God give people knowledge to know when to think fast. And by him giving us the knowledge, we were able to pretty much stop a person from technically could have possibly went into a coma could have possibly died in their sleep it could have been anything because this particular person is fighting for their pregnancy they have i don't know what the word was called because when um the doctor had talked to me over the phone the word was so long i was like i wasn't i'm 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 technically still in the medical field but I don't remember that word at all. And I'm saying, do I have my books? I know I have two books. But I think the book I needed the most, I don't have. Because I remember giving it to this young lady when I was in school. Because I pretty much had filled out all the answers. So she was able to, you know, compare her answers with mine and get through. But it has to do when a woman throws up all the time and can't keep food down so whatever that word is um or should i say that disease is they call it um that's what the young lady is going through so by us getting her to the hospital on time she's now doing better because she was starting to signs the eyes are sinking and you'll start looking like you know I don't like to how you say it? I don't like to talk about Ethiopians because I feel really sorry for them but the point is she started resembling the way they look um, malnutrition and that's when you know there's something, something wrong. And when a person can tell you they have not ate until about, uh, when the young lady started counting, I was like, what? But they haven't ate in like four or five days. Now, I, I know God did, I think it was, G, well, Jesus did fasting. 40 days, 49, I think that's what it was. <laughs> if I got it right, if I got the right man. And pregnancy is hard. It's hard. You know what I'm saying? So men out there that's listening to this, when your woman get pregnant, be ready to take full responsibility because sometimes these babies put something on these mothers that these mothers are fighting for their life. And when you have someone that's nagging you, aggravating you, and not trying to be there for you, it makes it even worse. So I'm thankful that God gave us the knowledge to help this person. Now, I'm thankful that I have a paid-for vehicle. I am thankful that I am able to provide food on my table. I am thankful that, you know, things are going to get better, you know, and it's a song that, as I told the young lady by Smokey Norfolk, I'm going to run this race, I'm going to take my proper place in the winning circle. I'm going to run anyway. Don't know where or when or how, but I know that I'm going to make it. Oh, I run this race, kneel so safely in amazing grace. Now I made up my mind, and I don't have much time, but I'll run till I finish. Oh, Oops, 
I made up my mind and I don't have much time. But I'll run till I finish. I almost lost my breath there. <laughs> Cause I've been having where my throat dries really easily. And um we believe it's the fan that I sleep with though. Cause I'm like, dang, why do my throat dry so much? <laughs> But I just wanted to throw that at y'all, you know, what I'm thankful for, you know. I'm thank oh, forgot the most important parts. I am thankful for my three grandbabies and my godson's daughter. Uh, at first I was like, I am too young to be a grandmother. So I had to let them know this is not a grandmother thing, this is a G mama. Glam mama, okay. Nah, don't call me granny, don't call me grandma. No, 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 that's not gonna work. So, I've been teaching them from day one. I am G mama, and trust me, three of them the, the, um, the godson, daughter, and the two sisters, trust me, they got that G mama. One of the sisters called me GG mama. And I'm like, I don't care. Just as long as they'll call me grandmother. But I am thankful. It's so weird because my boys have had babies first. <laughs> my girls have not had children yet. But, you know, I'm so thankful, though, that I can say I am a young grandmother. But I'm an old grandmother in reality because my kids have been over their 20s when they have had kids. They have been around 20, 20 and up. Because I'm trying to think, my baby son, how old? His baby was born last year. And I think my baby son is 21. Is he 21? Was he 21? He wasn't 21 when the baby was born. He was 20. So, and my son, his daughter is about three. She's about three going on four. So, and he's like almost, he close to his 30s. So, yeah, I got some children. <laughs> but just whoever's listening, looking at this video, I know it may be too late to say what you're thankful for. But it's really not. It's really, really not. You know, um, the plans for the rest of this season is to do Vlogmas. I'm so excited because I've never did it before. I was going to do it last year. But things were just so not there for me. But I really want to do Vlogmas this year just to participate with everybody else. Um, I have been doing good at doing five videos a week. And I am going to concentrate on doing Vlogmas so that, you know, I want to keep my Vlogmas more into the Christmas period. But if I'm just sitting at home doing something, I'm going to still try to show you what I'm doing. <laughs> so you can still have fun with Miss Trezina seeing what she is doing. I know yet next year, my plans right now is to start getting ready for next year. I will do my vision board and I'm going to show my old vision board showing what I have accomplished even though it was a tough rough year and I'm going to do my new vision board of what my goals are so that we can get you know started. Um, I do plan on having planners. One planner will be my business planner because I'm still trying to get my um, unique jewelry going. Um, I still have planners where it can be budgeting planners. I have a few clients who are enjoying them. Um, and many more stuff to come. It's a lot of more stuff that I plan on doing. I'm just taking it slow because of this year's finances have been tough on everybody. So I'm just still having faith that it's going to take off and running. Um, I'm just trying to think. Um, I know I'm going to... I don't know if I'm going to start a new profession because I'm probably going to work still. 
um, I'm still undecided what I'm going to do. But right now, my main focus is trying to get through the rest of this year. I plan on having a Merry Christmas. And if anybody I know is watching this video who knows me personally, I want to say Happy Thanksgiving. I hope you had the most beautiful Thanksgiving in the world. Normally, I text Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving to everybody. I didn't text nobody. I was so busy to the point where I just didn't have time to do anything. By the time I laid down, my feet were pounding and my head was too. Because I was trying to get that Thanksgiving video out the same day as Thanksgiving. I couldn't do it. So I had finished it on Thanksgiving, but I scheduled it for the next day. So I had two videos going that same day so that I can do my goal which is five videos a week so if you enjoyed sitting here early morning with Miss Trezina doing what I am thankful for please give it a big thumbs up if you are not a warrior yet go ahead and subscribe hit the notification button to be notified of all videos I plan on making next year funner than this year um it's a lot of investments i'm trying to do because i want i want my videos more clearer you know you got to crawl before you walk and i want you to enjoy them i want it to look like you know it's jumping out at you so it'll give you more fun i don't know about pranks and stuff i'm really not if i do it i'll do it with my kids or friends but um, I don't know. I'm just more of a DIY. I guess that's what how you call it, DIY. And I'm more of mukbangs. And let's talk about it. Let's chit chat. Um, Sunday dinner show. So I'm more of that type of girl, you know. I will be doing fashion videos. Right now, I was trying to lose a few pounds, tone up my body a little bit. Or I'm not going to even say lose pounds. I'm going to say tone my body up because all I want to lose is my stomach, you know. And, of course, I want to take a little bit of pounds off me. But I just feel if I can work on my stomach, then everything else will fall into place. So, this has been sort of a long video. I only wanted to do maybe 10 minutes and it's been way past that. But um, share this video. Let them know what your girl is doing. Um, let's keep it going. So the next person, tell what you're thankful for. Let's keep it rolling. Even if it's taken till Christmas, let's keep it going till the end of this year. What are you thankful for? So I want to say thanks for watching. Later. So come on, ride with me, ride with me, see where this thing goes.